Welcome to Paddy. Hello guys, welcome to the Paris vlog. I'm currently showing the boys and everyone else because um Ava's just picked a spot on her face in public. <laughs> I mean, yeah, pretty much. We are in Paris. We are just sat at Carat, I think it's called. I mean, I'm probably butchering it. But it's basically the TikTok place where like all the hot chocolates are and it looks unbelievable. We've saved the hot chocolate for after because we've all got crop and shirts. Um, and they're just on their way out. We've got some coke. Oh, sorry, the first dog. <gasps> We've seen our first dog. Oh, he's it's there. Hi. Oh, he's so fluffy. Our favorite thing to do in Italy was dog spotting and we've only seen one here so far. Thank you. Oh my God, yum, shit. Everything's now happening at once. This is a lot. <laughs> See ya. The um, hot chocolate's gonna be our dessert. So we've got some chips. And then, like I said, we've got Cropman shares coming out, hot chocolates, pastries, it looks like a good time. We're in this really cute little area as well. Brad gave us some little history notes on it. What's it famous for? No, that's, that was the other place. This is the most fashionable district in like the 18th, uh, 19th century. So all these houses would have been owned by really, really famous people. And, uh, <laughs> we were. Really fashionable. <laughs> These are good chips. Messy. Mmm. That smells unreal. It's like a proper mum's toasty. Yeah. Oh my god, my thing is salad. Whoa. She's big. Whoa. Oh my god. Yum, our hot chocolates are here and they <laughs> look unbelievable. This is like the hot chocolate in Italy though. Like when you get a hot chocolate, it's literally hot chocolate. the word, yeah. Unreal. I'm so excited about this. <laughs> We're really picking on George and this. <laughs> I look at her. Show me the other one with the hat on. The sun was in. <laughs> She's <laughs> 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 getting ready for America. <laughs> he didn't say no. Why? <laughs> oh. It takes me some childhood, it's so nice. Oh, our boy's going on. <laughs> 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 Those bats are very sweet yeah, too. Right. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Hello guys, I'm finally sharing my face in this vlog, but we have literally just checked into the hotel. Obviously after having our lunch, which was so, so nice. I know that place is always recommended on TikTok for the hot chocolates and you just have to go. Like I'm sure there's other cafes that do a very similar vibe, but they were just so good. Like they were 10 euros each, so a little bit more, or quite a lot more expensive obviously, but you are paying for the experience and the taste is 10, 10. And the rest of the food that we had was also really nice as well. So yeah, highly recommend that place. I will of course link like everywhere we go down below in the description in case you're heading to Paris anytime soon. If you want some recommendations, hopefully this will help. But like I said, we have just checked in. So I thought I'd quickly show you the room before we kind of mess it up a little bit and unpack. We are only here for three nights. Um, so we didn't want to spend too much on the hotel. We kind of tried to find somewhere that was a little bit more reasonably priced because Paris hotels can get very, very expensive very quickly. So I think this was about, I want to say like 600 pounds for all four of us for three nights for two rooms. So it was really reasonably priced. It was like under 200 pound each, which was amazing. So this is what it looks like. I'll leave the name of the hotel on screen. Um, the rooms are quite small, but just like everything you need. As you come in, you have a wardrobe here, which obviously has a full length mirror on it as well. And then to the left, we have this little desk area. And then this is the lovely bed. It's really comfy. I've just been sat here, hence why it's 
a little bit messed up. And then we have a window here, which I think literally just goes out, yeah, onto the rest of the building. Um, and then obviously the sky's up there. But then coming round, we have this TV with some more storage. Obviously a place to like put your cases and stuff, which is super handy. And then a teeny tiny little bathroom. But again, like everything you need. It's just nice and clean in here. Like it smells fresh. It looks clean. Like I'm more than happy with this. So yeah, obviously sink area. And then quite a big, decent sized shower to be fair. The guys are obviously just settling into their room and Brad has just popped to the shop to grab some moisturizer. There's literally like a supermarket over the road from here. So it's really convenient for that. And we obviously walked to lunch, which was like 20 minutes. So I can't remember exactly what avenue we're in or like district we're in, but so far it seems like a good location. Paris is huge. Like we went to look where the Eiffel Tower was and it's literally like a 40 minute journey from here, but we are still kind of central. So yeah, it's just like a really, really big city. So it just depends where you want to stay, what you want to like do while you're here. Anyway, we are going to have a bit of a chill right now. We've all been up since half four this morning and I didn't go to sleep until two because I was getting some work done. So I am like running on adrenaline and I'm definitely, like now I've sat down, I'm like I could do with a nap. So I think we're going to chill for a bit and then me and Georgia are going to get ready and then we'll head out a little bit later. We don't really have any plans while we're here apart from Disney on Tuesday, which I am so excited to go back to. Like me and Brad went for the first time last year and I was just obsessed like I literally have not stopped thinking about it since and I was never really like a Disney kid like I never went to Disneyland as a kid I was never fully into the movies like I liked them but I don't have like a favorite and things like that so I was really surprised by how much I did love it but that is like the only plan that we have otherwise we are just gonna walk around find some restaurants on TikTok that we like the look of and just have like a nice chilled three days. This is the first trip that I've not brought my laptop away with me, which feels really weird because I feel like I am literally glued to that thing, but it kind of feels nice. I'm just having like a proper break and like a bit of a detox, which is nice. But yeah, I'm gonna sit and chill and I will catch up with you guys a little bit later when I'm probably getting ready to head back out again. Brad is back from the shop and he went to get moisturizer, but he's come back with some macaroons. Are they actually macaroons? They look like cookies. They kind of like cookies. Macaroon chocolate. They're soft. Are they? Hmm. You've got that like, orange zest in it. Mm, that's not a bit of me. Okay, we are ready to head back out. I thought we'd just really quickly run through our outfits. I don't know how I'm still functioning. I'm literally running off two hours of sleep. <laughs> Georgia called me or FaceTimed me and I was literally laid in bed like on my side. She answered the phone and she was literally fully ready and I was like, um, so I've literally just thrown my makeup on in 10 minutes but my outfit is very plain and simple we're just super casual but trying to keep warm because it's a lot colder here than we thought it would be this jumpsuit I have on is from Opoly and then I've got my new balance on which I had on earlier my blazer is from Zara and then I've got my Sisters and Seekers hoodie because I just need another layering piece so it kind of ruins the outfit but I'm just going to put this on if I get cold later. And then I have my new little baby, my YSL bag, and that is me. I have my Air Force Ones. These are new. New white ones. Um, my ASOS jeans. I have a Zara baggy oversized jumper. Um, just a Zara t-shirt and then a Zara coat. We love Zara. We love Zara. <laughs> that is us ready to go. We're going to go and meet the guys now. I think they went downstairs and took some pics. So they're nice and organised and mm. I'm exhausted. Exhausted, the right word. <laughs> so we're gonna go meet them and then make a plan. I think we're probably gonna head for a drink. Um, we wanna try and find somewhere to watch the fight tonight because it's Tommy and Jake's fight. So I'm intrigued. Mm. We might find a sports bar or something and just watch that. <laughs> Road trip. Tour de France. It's like we're on a school trip. <laughs> um, we have headed over to the Eiffel Tower. I feel like it should be about 8 p.m. at this point. So we keep like going in and out of trains. I'm like, why is it still light outside? We've also had two hours sleep, so I think you think it's yeah, later than it actually. Yeah, I think I've just lost the plot. To be perfectly honest, it's 5 p.m. So we have the rest of the evening ready. Yeah. So we've come over. Oh, bro, I think we ate here before. I feel like we sat here and had a coffee when we came like eight years ago. 
reminiscing. Yeah, we thought we'd come to the Eiffel Tower. Oh, she's blustery. It's actually very cold, guys. We've not packed this sort of weather. Like, not one bit. I was packing for spring. What am I doing? Don't know. The sun's out, but it's five degrees. I'm freezing. Yeah, we just got the metro here because it was the easiest way to get here. And like, Easy, quicker, tall, cheap. Guys. Yeah, i.e. Brad. We're useless at those things. <laughs> Georgia especially. I can't I no lie. Sense of direction. I ever. love you, but I do. Oh, wow. There she wow. is. Wow. Here she is. Oh, this is cute. It's so windy, so I will film some clips of what we get up to and um, you guys can see. I'm on Emily's vlog. We've just been packed for more langos. We are. Had a couple wines. A couple is another statement. Yeah. Actually, no, we've literally had a couple. Yeah, two. Also, we are baking hot right now. Like, like it, the table My steam. phone doesn't work anymore. Temperature really? It's hot. I'm not complaining because basically we have. We're trying to lift both of these heaters above us, which are keeping us so nice and warm. Located here and here. Last time we saw you, we were at the Eiffel Tower, so we took some pictures. Literally so froze, cute. froze, froze to death. So cold, so cold. I think we've said this, but it is freezing. Do you know what? When we pack, we pack for spring, and it's packed for like Dubai. Dubai. We literally have. This is the warmest thing I have. Like I've got three layers on currently. Oh. Right, and we're still freezing cold. It's five degrees. The wind is. I've never felt wind like it. Baltic. Uh, someone just pulled up their pants right behind us. Um, so we basically came in here to like thaw out. Yeah. Like defrost we a little bit. We were defrosting. So tonight is the fight night where Tommy Fury and Jake Paul are fighting. Yeah. And Matt is currently on the phone trying to figure out if there is a sports bar that is showing the fight. Currently, none. Like, we called one of the bars and they were like, oh, I didn't even know there was a fight. Oh. Yeah, and he was Irish, which I was really surprised about. Strange. I love Paris so far. Yeah, it's just cute. Oh, we are waiting for 8 o'clock to come. The Eiffel. Until the Eiffel Tower starts. Yeah, now three minutes. Yeah. That's our plan. Yeah. We're going to go to the IP as well. I think I want my arm to be like that. Shine. 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 Says the guy who's got lemonade in his white wine. Pour it, you see, man. No, you're not. Oh, she's such a handsome Um, That's our plan. We thought we'd just check in because we haven't checked in in a while. It feels really weird because I should be looking at this one. I don't know who I'm looking at at this rate. Merry Christmas. This is actually your Christmas present. Oh, yeah. And now it's our birthday. Yeah, literally. So we go away before in a month. then. So, yeah. And it's technically not March, so it's technically not your birthday because I know that March is four months before your birthday normally. Yeah. So it's not quite your birthday yet. Yeah, exactly. day, the day after George's. So we come home on George's birthday. No, no, we don't. We come home the day before. The day before. Yeah. Don't panic me like that. Sorry. About that. Sorry. So if you were getting confused by this conversation, we actually are going to Turkey over our birthday because Matt is getting his done. How do you feel? You excited? Yeah. 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 And I didn't really want to come on my own because I would be sat on a beach on my own. So Em and Brad time, are coming with us to keep me company. I'm excited. And I'm going to be your Steve. Basically, we know every single time you see us here on a trip, we'll be with Mike. Yeah. I did say in my last video, I've not got any holiday without Em. 
Oh yeah, and we're going to Turkey with Sam and Mia in May. Yeah. In May. So, yeah, what and is February, February, March, April, May. Right, we need to go and see these um, twinkly lights. Twinkly lights! <laughs> right, we will see you at the twinkly lights. Um, are you changed? <laughs> I am freezing cold. We are at the Eiffel Tower. We're waiting for her to sparkle. Sparkle! But she's lit up in the Ukrainian flag. Yay! Look how stunning this is. The boys are in the queue over here getting hot dogs, crepes. I don't really know what they're up to, but I know I'm getting a hot dog and I'm happy about that. We're listening to Burner Boy, who we're seeing at Coachella in April, which we're very excited about. I don't know the words, but we'll learn them. I don't think anyone knows the words. True. And everybody wash your bed, child. Three minutes until this lights up and the boys are in the queue. They're not going to make it. We need to get some pics. I need to be on it with you. I'm excited. Let's do this. Guys, we're in a pub because we're watching the boxing with you. And they put it on just for us. So, we're playing dance to pass the time. Oh. <gasps> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm good. Shut the fuck up. I'm in. Guys, I just got a bullseye. You're lying. I swear on my life, I literally just got a bullseye. I'm proud of that. I've never got one in my life. Wait, I've still got another darts fray. Ready? Oh. So that's really a question for my partner. Okay. So we. <laughs> what is going on? Guys, I just got another one. Yeah, she's have a witness. I think it's because you've got your give me, the, give me a couple of wines and sign me up to whatever the darts event is because I don't know the name of it. You will get it. Will I? Yeah. Good morning. morning, day two in Paris. We just run back up to the room to add more layers. So I walked outside and it was cold. <laughs> so I've got my little cardigan. This cardigan is a game changer, it's so thick. Yeah, and it's great to layer. Oh, we're leaving. Oh, this is our little hotel by the way. She's really cute. Great location as well, from what we've seen oh, so far. Oh, lovely. I'm nice and warm now. Just throwing my hotel pee on the floor. Here's the boys. Where are we going to? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. George is trying to direct us. Can I just have a look at that? Yeah, it's Matt, already not going. Matt, take over. <laughs> yeah, you're all right. Can yeah. I just have a look at that, please? Just to double check. Um, but I'm not Dora the Explorer, <laughs> by any means. We are heading for some brunch this morning. Mm -hmm. We watched the fight last night and it was so good, but I've it never been tense. so nervous to watch something. Like, no. I don't really care about stuff like that. No. But I was just thinking about how Molly must be feeling. Like, she was at home obviously with the baby and I just think, how can Wild. she watch that? Like, we were stressed. All you'd want to do is just give him a massive hug. Yeah. Like, whatever way it went. Yeah. It was crazy. It was crazy. Yeah. I had a nap Tell me in one. the pub. Yeah, you literally did. We were so, so tired. tired yesterday. Like, I slept like a log. Mm -hmm. I also slept on my AirPod. So I woke up with an AirPod literally stuck in my arm and I've probably oh, got a bruise on my, on my arm now. Lovely. So that was quite sore. But um, yeah, last night was really fun. We're now going to head for some brunch. And then, again, we don't really have a plan, do we? No. We're just going to hang around. We want to go for a nice meal tonight nice. to celebrate our birthdays, which are literally in over two weeks. Three weeks. Right, we will keep you guys posted on what we get what up we to. to. The place of brunch looks lovely, so yeah. I'm very excited. I think it's very famous, and I think it might have been in Emily in Paris. Ooh! Which is basically me right now at this point. <laughs> but I just want a croissant. Really? Yeah. See, I want like other on toast or something. Oh, do you? Yeah, like something fresh. I'm or is it sure like a bakery? Is, yeah. Oh. Is it, well, um, it's a cafe, but. Well, in that case, I'll be happy with a croissant. Yeah. Happy with anything to be honest. I'm Paris. I want to go to that steak place for lunch. Oh yeah. The steak. The steak, the steak have, like, later dinner. Mm -hmm.
and we are now in the Louvre. Well, we're not in the Louvre. We're at where the Louvre is. <laughs> and it's just stunning. How do you feel, George Wells? First time I'm seeing really the Louvre. I'm annoyed about these puppets. Oh. I love it here. Other than that, we're loving life. I don't think we're going to go in because that queue looks like a no thank you from me. Busy. Yeah. Like very busy. We're going to have a wander around and then I think there's some. Oh, we're going to go and see the garden. Yeah. Have a little walk around, have a stroll. Probably get another food. drink, <laughs> eat some more food. We want to try the steak restaurant. Oh my god, Brad's jacket. Oh, damn it. If anyone's seen my vlog, and mine, like my Milan. Oh, really? Me and um, play, play a game called Brad's Jacket, and Brad's got this one jacket. And we're at 2 we haven't seen many. No, it's Italy, you need to go yeah. see it. Right, let's have a meet. Let's go. This is my favourite part of every day now. Brad gets Georgia to do the like classic tourist picture at any site we see, and it's so funny. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> it's always so funny because on my camera you're like way off, <laughs> like you're literally nowhere near. <laughs> That's funny, you're just gonna have a collection of me on your album. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be Georgia being a tourist. <laughs> Guys, we're in the Louvre. <laughs> we weren't gonna come in because the queue was so long, but TikTok being TikTok gave us a hack. And as you walk towards the gardens, like out of where the square is, um, on your right there are some stairs, and you just come down and you're in the Louvre. I mean, we might get around the corner and, and there might be a huge yeah. queue, but... So far, so good. This is massive. I know, honestly, me and Brad got lost here last time we came. Like, literally could not find the way out. We... Guys, we just had this <laughs> photo booth. <laughs> <laughs> it's so big. It's I'm also on the floor. Oh, oh cute! No. There's one? No, there's two. Ah. Oh. How good is... Oh. oh. I thought it was two. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, oh you wow. can get the photos, I think. Okay, lovely. Where's it focusing? We're back. We are currently on our way to the Arc de Triomphe, but we've made a pit stop at Laudre, I want to say. Laudry. The macaroon place. The macaroon place. And it's huge. So we've come out to the little cafe outside. We're just waiting for a table, but it looks so cute inside. And we're going to basically see if we all like macaroons or not. Yeah. Brad likes them. I've tried them before, and I think I liked it, but I only sort of nibbled them there. Yeah, like not had a yeah. good experience. It looks great inside, so yeah, we will take it over there. But we're still cold. Fun fact, I went to the shop because she needed hairspray. And I said to her whilst we're in this queue, like, do you want to just fix your hair? It's blowing everywhere. We go to fix it. It's moose. She's called moose. So she's just moosed her hair in the middle of the string. <laughs> with literally everyone watching me. But she looks great. Yeah, she's she slicked again. It's been so nice with walking because we've been in the sun and, like, there's no wind. Cold here, though. Really cold here because we're in the shade. But everyone looks toasty in there. This looks so cute. It reminds me of something out of, like, a fairy tale. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? All the cakes are in here. I'm kind of eyeing up these cakes instead of the macaroons. <laughs> Although those giant macaroons look great. We're finally in. It's yeah. taken a while. And we've decided to just have a little macaroon each, some drinks, and then we're gonna go and get the biggest sandwiches you've ever seen. Are they good? Are they good? We were gonna try our macaroons together. Oh. Candy. <clears throat> oh my god, that's chocolate. That's here. Wow. That looks thick. Oh, it smells like chocolate. Mm. 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 That's unreal. Not tastes like a brownie. Mm. Yeah. I usually don't like them because they're almond, but you can't even taste them. It's the flavour. I really like that. Turn out them. 
Didn't you get the ones that you got me from here? Not from yeah, Paris. I, it's the same I don't know, I it's a long time ago. We made it and Brad has a fact. One cool, well it's actually a couple of facts. The coolest fact um, is that uh, the all the people that are on it are all the people from the French Revolution um, and some of the Napoleon Wars. You see all like those like, figures which were in like the 18th, 19th century. And then uh, the coolest fact of them all is that there is a tomb underneath there of an unknown soldier in from World War One. What, he's just under there? I mean, it's stunning, but the traffic is absolute carnage because this is technically a roundabout and there are some crazy people in the middle of the road taking pictures right in front of it. And I don't know how they're doing it because this is like honestly so hectic. But there she is, the Arc de Triomphe. Got enough of his, his tiles <laughs> to match <laughs> in his oh bridge. My. And then from he that, no, then it hits a hip. And then from that hip on the other side, that can all be a bit different. Talking about work stuff. That can be a bit different. Oh, look at him in there. We have just got out the Uber and we have come to this little spot which looks really busy. It's kind of giving me Carnaby Street vibes. Yeah, without the lights. Without the lights. But it's called Martimontigoral. That's a good effort. Montigoral. Right guys, we need to go up this way. <laughs> guys, this is where we're going. FTG. And it looks 10 10 on Instagram, so I am intrigued. Food is here. I actually cannot go over there. This is a grilled cheese. So it's ham, cheese, mushrooms, and not really sure what else is in there. I think there's coleslaw in there as well, but wow. And then I've got coleslaw on the side. We've got some chips to share, which look great. And taste great. Oh, what do you get? Fried chicken and cheese sauce. Mm. Excuse me. Sorry. <laughs> How do I go about this? Just Oh my god. Matt's got the long and we've got grilled cheese. Is that it? Yeah, but it's like ham, mushroom, goat cheese, grilled cheese. Huh. And Brad's got fried chicken cheese sauce. Cheese sauce. I'm gonna get right to suck it in on me. <laughs> Hello everyone. We're on two vlogs again. We're in matching pajamas, but mine have shrunk in the wash. <laughs> Emily looks like she's borrowed them from me. But I look I've borrowed them for someone smaller than you. These are matching PJs from Primark, everyone. These are what they look like fresh. These are what they look like when you wash them. So yeah. go up a size, because we'll just never wash them. We we'll just don't wash them. I shrink every day in the tumble dryer. Apparently so do I. My top tonight, I put in the tumble dryer and I've not worn it since, and it's legit this big. <laughs> I'm going to show them, because that's really <laughs> Ooh. Oh, it's fine. But, stretches. But that's fine. goes back. We are now filming. So get ready with me. As part of a different video, because we're going out for some food. We've had a nap. We have had a nap. We're knackered. Like, we were just saying that early morning flights are great because you obviously get a full day, but mm. it really just messes you up. It knocks you for six. It does, doesn't it? it? All those steps those boys keep making us do. You know when you wake up from a nap and you feel a bit, like, lethargic, but you're a bit giggly? Yeah. That's how I feel. I feel a bit not really sure where I am. <laughs> what day is it? What time? What time? <laughs> what time? <laughs> We got dinner at half ten, so a late dinner. Yeah, late lunch. It's now ten to nine. Oh, we've got an hour and fifteen. Yeah. This will be a video on George's channel, by the way, for my vlog. If you want to go and watch, we we'll get ready with us in Paris. And we're just gonna chat. Probably. <laughs> so I am now ready for dinner. Me and Georgia filmed a Get Ready With Me, which will be over on her channel if you want to go and watch it. We literally just chatted and got ready together. 
Um, so it was a nice chill video, but this is my outfit. I have my jeans from H&M. These are like the only H&M jeans that actually fit me. <laughs> like they're actually long enough. And then my shoes are really old from Zara. I'm not obsessed with them, but I don't hate them. So we're going with them. My blazer is Zara. Um, my little top is Princess Polly. These are like Skims dupes and they are great. And then I've just got my little Louis bag for tonight. And that is me done. So we're going to head and meet the guys now. And then I think get an Uber to dinner. We're going to like a really nice rooftop restaurant. I think it's Asian. So I'm very excited for some sushi, some good food and to see the views of Paris. So yeah, I will keep you posted when we're there. Bradley, what is your outfit of tonight? We kind of look the same, my love. The boys always pack just rucksacks and there's me and Georgia with our literal cases. Oh, my flies are in them. Oh. <laughs> Got my ASOS jeans on. I think this is a Zara t-shirt actually, a really old one. Yeah, I think it is. My Zara coat, because this is the only coat I've got. And then my Air Force. Fresh Zilliani. Air Force ones. Air Force I've got as well. Any shoes you've got? Any shoes I've got. Let's go eat some yummy food. And I walked back, so I said to Matt, where's your room? Because you told me 206, but we're 206. We're 205. 205. Yeah, I can actually. Do you know the... Room? Oh, <laughs> that's why you can hear me. Yeah. I've, the amount of times I've literally yeah. nearly walked into yeah, their room. Literally. Is a joke. This is G Wowser's outfit. She looks great. It's shrunk and washed. Like big time, but it's fine. Oh, <laughs> Are we all excited for dinner? Yeah. Rooftop views and sushi. Yay. Look how cute this lift is. Although it's not cute because this. Watch Aggressive. this. Actually, I got trapped in that. <laughs> it is when it hits you on the back. sushi and like sharing stuff so we're just gonna order a few bits. I'm totally okay with that because I'm not over the room. Neither and I've just seen they have burrata and tomatoes so give me that and I'll be so happy. With sushi? I don't care. I'll eat that with cereal. Anything. Literally. But the views, I mean you would have seen a sneak peek but I literally cannot go over this. There's the Eiffel Tower in all her glory. Wow, she just did a spin for me. The light came round. So we're gonna watch that sparkle, um, obviously on the hour. But this is the vibe in here, it's very cute. Yeah, there's a lot going on in here, I'm not gonna lie. Like when we first walked in, there was, did you see them stop as soon as we walked yeah. in? There was this couple and they were like, I felt, I felt like I walked into like a house party. Yeah. Like they were fully getting with each other, which was quite entertaining. And they literally stopped and looked at us and was like, and I was like, I don't want you to walk and like carry on like you do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's cute. So we will keep you posted. I'm trying to figure out what cocktail I want to drink. I'm thinking something fruity. Sunrise time. Where's that? Not really small. I think it'll come up like that. Vodka rhubarb. Pepper there. You like rhubarb. See, I'm thinking the rum. Kashaka? Pineapple and orange. We have just come outside because. I mean, this looks incredible. I'm kind of scared I'm going to trip over something because I can't see the floor. Oh, it's fine. <gasps> Jewel, you can get so close to the edge. <laughs> Look at this view. Like, literally a 360 view of Paris. This is insane. Unreal. Wow. Unreal. How cool is that? Here she comes. 
Whoa. Is this like we're in a movie? Mm -hmm. What is going on? We just went outside and froze it after taking pics, but I'm hoping yeah. it's worth it. Um, got over here. Yeah, spicy like mine. No, it's smooth and soft. Yours just needs a bit of a stir. <laughs> See ya. Oh, that's awful. Really? Yeah, it tastes like bath water. Okay, never drank my bath water. <laughs> Creamy bath water. I quite like it. I want to show everyone your pics because they were just unbelievable. Okay. Yeah. We literally oh. took these just with our phone torch. Obviously with the view in the background. Stunning. Who is she? She's not, but she. No. She. No. <laughs> <Main> she. <character>. Unbelievable. <laughs> and then That's we saw that Brad was watching us, so we started waving him. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> it's such a good walk. Such it's a good, good pick location. Like yeah. If you come on like a girl's trip, like the pics here are mm -hmm. Imagine in the day as well. I know. 10-10. Happy.